The foundation of all foundations and the pillar of wisdom is to know that there is a primary being who brought into being all existence. All the beings of the heavens, the earth, and what is between them came into existence only from the truth of his being. If one would imagine that he does not exist, no other being could possibly exist. If one would imagine that none of the entities aside from him exist, he alone would continue to exist, and the nullification of their existence would not nullify his existence because all the other entities require him, and he, blessed be he, does not require them nor any one of them. Therefore, the truth of his being does not resemble the truth of any of their beings. This is implied by the prophet's statement in Jeremiah chapter 10, verse 10, And God your Lord is true. As an example, he alone is true, and no other entity possesses truth that compares to his truth. This is what is meant by the Torah's statement, Deuteronomy chapter 4, verse 35, There is nothing else aside from him. As an example, aside from him, there is no true existence like his. This entity is the God of the world and the Lord of the entire earth. He controls the sphere with infinite and unbounded power. This power continues without interruption because of the sphere is constantly revolving and it is impossible for it to revolve without someone causing it to revolve. That one is He blessed be he who causes it to revolve without a hand or any other corporal dimension.